Ou alors Val d'Europe. Val d'Europe, là il faut passer par Châtelet. Il faut prendre le RERB au deuxième sous-sol pour aller à Châtelet ouais. et ensuite le RERA en direction de Marne-la-Vallée. Ouais, c'est dans le même aspect. Voilà, c'est le mot. Ouais, ouais, ouais. Je vais vérifier. Non, merci. Je crois que c'est Gare de Lyon ou Gare de l'Est, mais bougez pas, je vais vérifier. C'est Gare de l'Est. Gare de l'Est. France FAQ number 2 from Addicted to France. What's open on May 1st in France? La fête du travail. May 1st is a holiday in France because it is la fête du travail, a day off for workers to celebrate the eight-hour workday. This is a celebration that originated in the United States on May 1st, 1886, and has since spread all over the world, including France. But May is a popular travel month, so a common question I get is, what happens on May 1st in France? This is an excellent question because you do not want to be caught off guard and lots of people are surprised how many things are closed on Labor Day in France. Does everyone take May 1st off? Yes, pretty much. Most people do not work on May 1st. As a result, here are some places where you will find closed doors. City buses, trams and metros will not run anywhere except Paris. No public transportation in Lyon, Marseille, Toulouse, Bordeaux, etc. No public transportation in smaller French cities either. Paris is the exception to this rule. There are some metros and RER trains, RER trains, but at much slower frequency. You will have to wait possibly with lots of other people. Stores will be closed. There will be exceptions, but most stores will be closed. Many restaurants will be closed, especially outside of Paris. In Paris, if you're in Paris proper and you're near the center, you should be fine. Almost all museums will be closed all over France. A few smaller museums stay open in Paris. Check their website to make sure. So, what stays open in France on May 1st? Hotels, hospitals, a few pharmacies, they are called pharmacies de garde, a few restaurants, of course. It will be easier to find restaurants in Paris than other places. Disneyland Paris will be open and extremely crowded. The Eiffel Tower is normally open on May 1st. Les bateaux mouches and other cruise boats on the River Seine should be open. The Sewer Museum in Paris is open on May 1st. It's a stinky place. We talked about it on episode 125. But you know what? It's, a, it's an interesting visit. Airports obviously will stay open with a reduced number of domestic flights and Trains will run also on a reduced schedule. So, what can you do as a visitor on May 1st in France? If you're only in France for a short time and you want to find something to do, Google the venues you have in mind to make sure they are open. Make plans as to how you will get there. Please note that if you're thinking of renting a car to get around Paris that day, you will find the roads very busy and parking spaces very difficult to find. My strategy is to plan on walking around pleasant places such as public parks, beautiful streets, wherever I happen to be. In Paris, I love to walk around Ile de la Cité, followed by a stroll along the Seine River. You could also go visit the Canal Saint-Martin, which thankfully has gotten better since the episode on it, episode 119, was published. You could also participate in one of the many manifestations taking place all over France, a large one in Paris starts at Place de la Bastille. Google the term Manifestation du 1er mai Paris to find one that suits your taste. But be aware that depending on the political climate and possibly terror alert, 
there may be some rough and strict policing going on. So as a rule, I stay away from these manifestations, especially the huge one that Marine Le Pen holds every year in Paris on May 1st. I don't know what's going to happen this year, so I wouldn't go. Most French people will be hanging out with family or practice their favorite sport. It is a day of rest and relaxation. I hope you have a great time on May 1st and don't try to make it a typical tourism day where you pack too much in. Sleep in, enjoy the spring weather and have a laid back day like the rest of France. Au revoir. This episode is licensed under the Creative Commons Attribution Non-Commercial Non-Derivatives International License.